Hey, Cap. As a cameraman, I've been capturing your best moments in the ring, and so far, electrifying. But here's an idea to get even more eyeballs on you. A lightning fast, jaw dropping match. Defeat Tamina in less than three minutes, and the higher ups will have no choice but to grant you more opportunities. A leader in or out of the ring. The captain. The following is scheduled for one fall. Making her way to the ring from Newcastle upon Tyne, England. From indie legend to WWE superstar, Cap is always ready for action. Yeah, this isn't some smoke-filled bingo hall, Saxton. It's WWE. If the so-called captain wants to prove herself here, she's got to do it in the ring. Cap is here, and she's ready to fight. Tamina is here, and I think it's safe to say Tamina is angry. Nobody's meaner than Tamina. And from the Pacific Islands, Tamina! She's won the women's tag team titles. She's competed at WrestleMania. And you know what? It's kind of nice to see Tamina finally getting her flowers. Well, Tamina strikes me as the kind of woman who will take those flowers and smash you over the head with them. She has been counting the weeks, the days, the minutes until this match, and she is now ready to compete. Is it just me, or does Cap seem more determined than ever tonight? I agree. She does seem to have a little extra spark. She might be hoping to make quick work of Tamina. She's going to need more than a spark. We've all seen firecrackers fizzle out before. She's pushed into the corner. Oh, another oh, one for good measure. Acrobatics like that take a tremendous amount of cardio and strength. She's got her where she wants her. Up high. Oh, right to the face. Kick gets caught. Dodges out of the way. Brutal form. Then here come the punches. I think rage took over in that moment. Nothing but blind rage. Tamina being controlled by the opposition here. Tamina has to devise a new plan here. That offense taking a toll on her. Uh-oh. Counter from Tamina. Tamina showing how much punishment she can withstand before dishing it back tenfold. Tamina hoping to start a rush of her own with that attack. And Tamina didn't see that coming. Oh. She got her down. Is this it? She gets a quick kick out there. At this point of the match, I'm not surprised. Close fist connects. Oh, side coming. A stalemate going head to head, putting each other to the test. Just teeing off with that fight for everybody. She scores big with the counter. Big shots being fired right now. Neither competitor laid up. Oh, what a roundhouse. Taking hold of Tamina here. Oh, Tamina's in crisis mode. And that'll about do it, folks. Here is your winner. Yeah. A tough loss for Tamina. She's going to remember this one for a long while. This is what you get when you have complete confidence and control of the situation.
great to see you in a WWE locker room cap. Although a little surprised considering what you said about this place while we were on the indies together. What can I say? I'm trying new things. You don't have some secret beef with me like Shotzi apparently does. Honestly, I don't know what her deal is. You were always great to me when I was booked at TBD. Glad to hear it. So what's your game plan here? Game plan? I don't know what you mean. Keep having matches, win, repeat. Oh, geez. What? You're on a different level now. You can't just do what you've always done and expect to succeed. You have to do the work. For instance, it's not just winning, it's how you win. What do you mean? Winning in ways that make an impact. I know you know your stuff, but I'd be happy to give you some WWE specific pointers. I trained wrestlers while I was on the indies, so I'm used to helping people find their groove. I actually appreciate that a lot, Candace. I'm trying to put my best foot forward here. Of course, lesson one, making your opponent tap makes a statement to both WWE Universe and the locker room. Everyone's talented around here, but if they acknowledge you in the ring, they have to acknowledge you behind the curtain. Reasonable enough. I know you have a match with Chelsea Green coming up. Make her tap and win by submission. Bringing indie cred and attitude to the WWE ring, it's Cap! The following is scheduled for one fall. Making our way to the ring from Newcastle upon Tyne, England. Ugh. The look of determination on Cap's face speaks volumes, Corey. This is a woman looking to climb all the way to the top of WWE. It's good to have goals, but we're just going to have to see if she has what it takes to make the climb. I have my doubts. Cap is on a mission tonight. Guys, here comes the hot mess. Uh, emphasis on mess. Bite your tongue, Saxton. And from Victoria, British Columbia, Canada, Chelsea Green. Chelsea Green won many major titles from independent promotions, but now is one of the top names in WWE. Uh, and Michael, she's pretty much annoyed every general manager she's ever encountered along the way, too. Chelsea's ready to make a hot mess out of the competition tonight. Two emerging superstars both trying to make a big statement tonight. Shouldn't they want to make a big statement every night? You're right, Corey, but from what I've heard, there might be some extra motivation for Cap in this match. Right hand after right hand. This is ugly. Every strike more devastating than the last. Taking a moment to get pumped off of this crowd's incredible energy. Snap mail right. Surfboard. She's trying desperately to make it to the bottom rope and maybe. And uh, finally breaks it. She's lucky she got out in time. Turnbuckle's the only thing keeping her upright. Chelsea on the receiving end. Looking bad for her here. Just driven into the mat. Lift off, taking it on the mouth. Mm -hmm. 
Has the leg trapped. Fisherman suplex into the pin attempt. She kicks out in one. Still no end in sight here. Oh. Double under hook. Nice butterfly suplex. Goes into the pin. She kicks out with authority. Just looking for ways to wear out her opponent. Fez press. Green is being stifled in this one. Green has to find a way to right the ship here. Oh, and a forearm smash. Oh, what a forearm. She's starting to tire a little. They've definitely taken their lumps at this point. Their opponent is not messing around. She turns it right around with a counter. Ooh, forearm connects. Into the corner. This can't be good. Ooh. Another a one for good measure. And goes down with the sling blade. Snap man right. Surfboard. She is desperate to get out of this submission some way, somehow, and she does. Miraculous. Canadian Destroyer! We got a road break. Ooh, this is kick to the spine. Chelsea just rubbing it in now. Chelsea Green about to close this one down. Elbow thrown to break up the goal. That could end Chelsea's night. Looking to cinch in the Dragon Sleeper. Dragon Sleeper is applied. She's in a tremendous amount. She does break out of it, but has the damage been done? Jaw shattering boot. Forearm after forearm, vicious attack. Oh no, trapping the arm. A vicious stomps to the hand. Ducking out of trouble. Big back body drop. What elevation. Ah, oh, look at this. Hair pull net slam. Well scattered reversal there. The roundhouse connects. We got their opponent hooked. There it is. Dragon sleeper. Not sure why, but she releases the hold. Well, I think she's Chelsea Green in her clutches. Oh, man, into the neck breaker. Oh. Leave the night light on for his. Look this, Byron. With your forehead, Sergio, draining all the energy out of the opposition. Man, she's got a lot of heart and a lot of guts. This singles contest has a victor. Chelsea Green is absolutely not going to be happy about this loss. Chelsea, no doubt, going to find the nearest manager to try and reverse this decision. Ah, yeah, good luck with that. Hey, mind filling me in on this pitch that Troy messaged me about? Apparently, I had a very good idea. Oh, sorry. I meant to tell you about it first, but I got too excited and I couldn't stop myself from spilling to Troy. But it's good, I promise. <laughs> okay. Your submission match definitely increased your buzz within the WWE universe, but what could make an even bigger impact while keeping it fresh. You tell me. Knocking out your opponent. Well, wouldn't be the first time. Exactly. And the WWE Universe will eat it up too. Troy's putting it all together and Piper Niven's in. Apparently, she's still got some lingering issues about a former name she had and wants to blow off steam. 
it'll be an official WWE sanctioned KO match. I like it and I'm excited. I've got some steam of my own to blow off. That's the spirit. Believe me, it'll pay off. Here she is, the formidable and unflappable Cap. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making her way to the ring from Newcastle upon Tyne, England. Ew! Cap looks like she is itching to throw hands tonight. And she's come to the right place. Her opponent wants nothing more than to take that big indie reputation and drag it through the mud. The captain is ready to call the shots. A dominant force in the women's division. Absolute sheer aggression. And from Ayrshire, Scotland, Piper Niven. No nonsense, no more gimmicks, just Piper Niven. And all she wants to do is drop the competition. <laughs> that was decent, Corey. I have my moments. Niven looks ready to knock out anybody in the women's division. I've been waiting for this all night. We've rarely seen a knockout match. First superstar to knock out their opponent gets the win. Good luck trying to knock Piper Niven out. <laughs> Incoming. Crash landing. I felt the vibration of that one from all the way over here. Oh, quite an effective counter. Good contact. It has to be demoralizing to just get slapped like that. If that doesn't fire you up, I don't know what will. Oh, another A one for good measure. Agility like that is what can set you apart from the rest of the locker room. And look at her feeding off the WWE Universe's energy. With the Lariat. Telling her opponent that she has even more left in her tank. We all know what she's looking to do next. Here we go. Whoa, look out. Adrenaline can make you do crazy things. Exhibit A right there. Oh, colliding with a barricade. No telling what's underneath the ring tonight. And she's pulled out a steel chair. That could be an equalizer inside the ring. Oh, lights out. And Piper is failing to offer any resistance here. Niven's got to find a way to put her best foot forward here. <laughs> and she gets herself out of a precarious position. Go to the right suplex. And Niven is showboating right now. Ooh, refusing to let her get into her head. Oh, oh Benning heel kick. How to rock anybody. Holy, meet the barricade. Oh, and a barricade. And now thrown back into the ring. Got her in her sights and making clear. All right, snapping her back to reality. This isn't a pose off. This is going to be stiff, vicious backdrop suplex. Well executed. 
back suplex. She's beginning to flag a little. Moved at the right time. Planted face first. How's that for a counter? Oh, Buster. Tagging this outside. This could be good. Uh-oh. I don't know what she has planned with that kendo stick. And here come the punches. And with an onslaught of strikes like that, it's clear they have nothing but punishment on their mind. Uh-oh. Oh, yeah. She is really getting fired up. A huge miss. There's bad timing, and then there's whatever you want to call that. Has an answer for Niven. Another reversal. Eye for an eye here. Brought out of ringside and back to the mat. There it is. Boom. Nice. Sharp knee. Piper taking a step back and measuring her. Putting a stop to all of her showboating. Just an incredible amount of lower body strength displayed there. Piper Niven in harm's way. Oh, man, into the neck breaker. Oh. Niven in big time jeopardy. We're going to finish it off. Swan Tong Bomb. <laughs> Quick thinking from Piper. Oh, nailed the midsection. Fire with a straight shot there. Answering back. Oh, that backfire. Boom. Enable the counter. Looks like a hockey fight's just broken out. So much pride, so much resiliency on display. Then here come the punches. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Niven avoids the attack. Just blasting back with an elbow to the face. Oh my goodness, just strike it at will. And Piper is failing to offer any resistance here. Niven's got to find a way to put her best foot forward here. She's getting back up, but she might be down again soon. Good luck getting up from that. She's pumping herself up, reaching out for that burst of energy. She's taking this outside. This one cannot be lost by countout. She wants to finish this. Boom! Oh! And she maintains this consistent offense. Yeah, she is absolutely showing no remorse. Slowly getting up, but she won't like what she's met with. Change of plans and slam down for their efforts. Oh, she's going under the ring now. Oh boy, come on, not the chair. An elbow will break that up. Going for it again. Conscious. The official has to call it. Here is your winner. Yeah. And Piper Niven has to be incensed by this loss. Not a whole lot more Piper could have done in this match. She left it all out in the ring tonight and still came up short. Hey, any chance you've been talking to Candice LeRae lately? Yeah, how did you know? Well, uh, believe it or not, I've seen this before. Notice anything in common about your last two opponents? They both lost to me? True, but they also both worked the indies, like you. So? 
Candace has this thing about being seen as the best wrestler around here who came out of the independent scene. Someone new comes in, she talks up ring work and brutal finishes above all else. And those brutal finishes? The more the other indie darlings take each other out, the more Candace can stand tall as the indie queen. So Candace is using me? Big yep, unfortunately. She even talked up about how she used to... Used to train wrestlers on the indies. Heard that before, too. Honestly, I'm not sure why Candace holds on to her indie street cred so hard. It's something to be proud of, for sure. But she takes it to a pretty extreme level, trying to eliminate all competition. Honestly, knowing that she's been manipulating me like this makes me pretty angry. I've been taking her at her word that she's been trying to help me. It makes me angry too. I mean, I came from the Indies and I don't manipulate people. At least not in that way. And I don't understand why someone would want to be known for what they've done over what they're doing now. If someone was talking about my indie work as opposed to what I've accomplished in WWE, yeesh. Don't say suck in the past. You're here to build your future. Anyway, something to think about when you're dealing with Candace. A leader in or out of the ring. The captain. The following contest is an Iron Woman match. Making her way to the ring from Newcastle upon Tyne, England. Ugh. From indie legend to WWE superstar, Cap is always ready for action. Yeah, this isn't some smoke-filled bingo hall, Saxton. It's WWE. If the so-called captain wants to prove herself here, she's got to do it in the ring. Cap is here, and she's ready to fight. Say hello to Mrs. Wrestling. And from Riverside, California, Candice LeRae. One half of the WWE's resident power couple. I'm not in the ring, Saxton. Candace is all smiles until the bell rings. Hey, a big opportunity for Candace here. Start the clock in this Iron Woman match. The captain and Candace LeRae are going to put it all on the line to see who can best rep their indie cred on the big stage. With these two, I'm going to predict a high scoring affair. This should be good. Heads out of the ring, what's next? Into the barricade. Oh. Whip right into the barricade. Oh. Getting carried, unsure what they're thinking. What now, what now? Into the barricade. She's getting fired up, ready to show her opponent what she's got. Yeah. 
Double stop. And surely she hears how high the referee's count has gotten at this point. Well, if she does, maybe she just doesn't care. She heads out of the ring. Interesting strategy. Unbelievable athleticism. Well, this is a warning to grab our stuff and go. Keep it in the ring, please. Saxton's a very fragile boy. Ah, uh, took off the, uh, the hood of the announce table. Yes. Now there go the monitors. Sad intentions in mind here. Come on, Byron, get in front of me. No. Forget about pandering to the WWE Universe. That should keep her head in the game. And with an onslaught of strikes like that, it's clear they have nothing but punishment on their mind. Unbelievable athleticism. Placed in the corner. Reversal. Can she capitalize? Got the front face lock applied. Nice suplex. Punch straight to the face, staves off the attack. Finds the advantage after a string of counters. Takes down their opponent. Kicks right on the side of the face. And she goes for the pin. And a kick out before even one there. A little over eager with that cover. Big time move coming up. Shot. Climbing the ropes. Front face lock into a superplex. Any move from the top like that is nearly catastrophic. Gets the shoulder up after one. She likely knew that wasn't enough. She's just keeping the pressure on. She's got to be careful here. The referee will count her out. And she is now laying her opponent on the announce desk. Standing precariously on the announce desk. Oh, boom to the floor. She's looking highly motivated, getting hyped up. Not out here. What? Big time risk pays off. The daredevil in you comes out when you take risks like that. The ref may call a count out soon, guys. You do not want to test this ref. Oh, my God. This press. And that was offense with a hurtful purpose. This match is spilled out to the ringside area. And as we can see, tension's really running high now. Uh, yeah, we should probably clear the way, guys. thinking about what to do next here. Oh, man. They're going to wear down their opponent. Oh, with the heel hook stretch. Watch out. They're coming towards the announce desk. What the hell are you doing, Byron? back into the ring. Byron, I love this move. This is one of my all-time favorites. The Wicked Stepsister. Can you believe it? Candice LeRae. Oh, what the stop. Will it be? And an effective pin. Looks like there's some more fight left in her. Fails to connect. Springboard. Scoreboard. Shoulders are down. No kick out at two. We're past the halfway point. We're all tied up as the clock is becoming a bigger factor in this match. And things cannot be more even in this matchup as we are all knotted up. Larray creates an opportunity.
Oh, that gets reversed on LeRae. She wants to take this one outside the ring, it seems. Oh, no. She's got her on our announce table. This is not going to end. Hoist it up. Oh, my gosh. Oh, to the table. A wake of destruction and demolished announce table. These two are dead set on destroying each other. At this point, this is incredibly ill-advised. You're in the middle of a match. What's she waiting for? She's looking more focused on gesturing rather than winning. She's in danger of a count out here. I don't know if she cares. Lorraine's <laughs> on her last breath. Pin. And she gets the fall early in the match. Position to be caught in here. Oh, what a chop! Climbing the ropes. Front face into a superplex. Cover. There's two. No, she kicks out. So, so close. That could have been it. Ooh, stop to the back. Double stop. Time is close to its end as the scoreboard shows a one-fall lead. And with a one-fall advantage here, there's a decision to be made. Do you stay on the attack or play defense? Every maneuver being returned with counter fire. Arm ringer in control. But this opponent still fighting back. She kicks out with force. I'm having a hard time believing that one. Oh, roundhouse kicks and then a leg sweep. Sweep the leg. Oh, could this be it? Oh, man, into the neck breaker. Oh, what a great move. She sneaks one in there. to the surfboard stretch. Oh, this she is in deep, the... deep trouble. She needs to find a way out. She's desperately doing so. It's successful. She's getting back to her feet. But is there fight left? She's staying elusive. That'll teach her to waste precious time in the ring. Ooh, take that. Skull first. Down by two falls this late in the match has to be an albatross around the neck. Oh, Roundhouse connects. And the cover! Two. Breaks the close count. She just dug down deep there, but I don't know if she'll be able to do it again. She shoots up the top rope. Danger from the top. Sean, absolutely no apprehension to putting one's body on the line. physical matches we've ever seen. An Iron Man match takes a huge toll, but you're seeing the result of pushing through that to win.